All right, so it's been quite a while since we've done one of these sticker videos on the channel. And the reason I know that is because we currently have 38, 38 special stickers, which is kind of crazy. And usually we like to do between 10 to 15 stickers per video, but since it's been so long and since I have so many, let's go ahead and spend at least 20, maybe even 25 here. We'll see how I feel. But yeah, with that said, we'll start with the first unit, which I've been wanting to give a sticker to since I pulled them, and that would be the tech androids. Now, usually Dokkan Fist units have, I would say, fairly disappointing effects, but I don't really care since uh, this unit does have a lot of meaning to me. So here we go. First sticker out of the way. Let's see this effect here. Hopefully it's good, and it is decent. I think that's decent. It's not really too special, and yeah, like I said, it's kind of weird where Dokkan Fist units are supposed to be some of the strongest units in the game. They're supposed to be some of the, I guess, rarest units in the game, but for some reason, they kind of shaft them when it comes to effects, at least for the new ones. Some of the older Dokkan Fist units, like the Fizz Cooler, or the uh, Fizz Beerus, um, who else? Uh, Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta, for example, like, those guys got amazing effects, for, but for some reason, yeah, some of the more recent Dokkan Fest units, some of the more recent Dokkan Fest cards, just didn't really get that love, you know, so, yeah, I don't know what that's all about, but anyways, one out of the way, um, it was fine, it was fine. Second one, uh, let's go over to Acquired, because I want to give one to this guy right here, the AGL. Transforming Trunks, here we go, and this one's kind of like a package deal because we get the base form as well as the Super Saiyan form. So there's the base, I like that, I like the swirls, that looks good. And let's check out the Super Saiyan Trunks as well. Oh, that's clean. Oh, that's clean. Okay, that's much better. <laughs> that's much better. We got the glow of the aura as well as the, the blue swirls, so... Uh, yeah, I'm not really too disappointed by that. I gotta say, this one definitely made up for the disappointment of the tech androids. So, there we go. That's a winner. That is the AGL Trunks. Uh, next up, let's do... Oh, of course. Kellen Khalifla. And this is also a package deal. We got the Kellen Khalifla. We also got the Kefla as well. So... You know, that's not, that's not bad. That's not bad, because what I like about it is the two different colors. You know, we got the red on the Khalifa side. We got the blue or the turquoise, I guess, on the Kale side. So there's some variety there, I suppose. It's not that great, though. Okay, so let's check out the Kefla as well. Kefla is looking quite clean that that's quite clean whenever we have at least two effects whenever we have you know some kind of like a swirly like uh what do you even call this at the bottom here some kind of like a stream effect and then also the glow of the aura um i'm usually a big fan so she looks quite good that's like a 7.5 out of 10 for me you know so for context a 10 out of 10 would be something like the Fizz uh, 120 lead cooler, which is this guy right here. Like, that to me is like a 10 out of 10. Like, I don't know, it's just something about units with like big uh, circles in their art. I almost said big balls, but <laughs> that sounds weird. So, yeah, big circles, big balls, whatever you want to say. Anytime you have those big orbs in the art, it usually looks very good. Like, Another example would be the uh, Tech Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta right there. So yeah, that looks very clean. That's like a 10 out of 10, or at least like a 9.5 out of 10 for me. And uh, none of these guys so far have really reached that level, but Kefla was probably my favorite up to this point. All right, let's check out the... Uh, I 
maybe STR um, Bedell. Now she's not a unit I use a lot, she's not a unit that I necessarily care about having a sticker on, but she is an amazing unit, so I think just out of respect we should give her a sticker, and I regret it already because it is pretty basic. <laughs> it is pretty basic, and I don't think the changed art really makes a difference either. Um, yeah, it's it's essentially the same thing. No, it's literally the same thing. In terms of effect, of course, her hair changes and stuff, so. Alright, well, i um, not going to say a waste of a sticker, but definitely not a great use of one, that's for sure. Um, next up, who should we give sticker number 5 to? Was it 4 so far? I think it was 4 so far. Um, number 5, let's go for... AGL Kid Gohan. Here we go. He does have the orb in the middle, so... Well, orb-ish, I guess. Okay, yeah. I was hoping the Masenko, or no, sorry, the, um... Just, just, just like that, that yellow, like, area in the middle would have more of an effect to it, you know? Like, they should have done something with that. They should have at least given it like a kind of aura vibe. I don't, I don't know. Like they just, they're lazy, man. They're really lazy. Like I don't understand. I don't understand. This is a more recent Dokkan Fest unit, and it seems like all the recent Dokkan Fest units just get crappy effects, man. It's, it's disappointing. It really is. So I think what we gotta do instead of giving. You know, stickers to the newer units, we gotta go back to the older units, you know, the ones that recently got easy A's and stuff like that. So, um, let's do the Androids category here. Uh, let me find it. Androids. It should be somewhere up top. If I remember. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, so Androids, and I'm gonna be giving stickers to the 217s that just got their easy A's, because they are both very, very good. And I think I remember someone telling me that I should give them stickers. I, I don't know if that was out of respect or out of... That's pretty good. <laughs> that's that's pretty good. Um, 7.5. 7.5. I like um, what they did with the, the orbs in his hands. That's probably my favorite part of the, of the sticker effect here. It's not bad, okay, okay. So AGL, solid. Let's see the int one as well. He has a big ball. Oh, he has big balls, so this one should be good. Oh! Yeah, yo. <laughs> what did I tell you, man? Anytime we have big balls, it's usually a winner. And this guy, I think, blows the AGL one out of the water. It's not really close to me. Um, I I like that a lot, man. That that just looks that just looks looks dope. That looks dope to me. Um, yeah, that's like an eight point five. That's an eight point five. Not quite on the bit cooler. Oh, another one I really like. Uh, let me just quickly show you guys so you know I have good taste. Uh, is the uh, Omega Shenron, as you can see, massive, massive sphere on top, and this guy is actually, he probably has my favorite effect in the entire game, actually. You know, it's the combination of the aura, the, the, you know, like, yellow lines going up towards the big ball, and then the effect of the ball itself, like, it just all works really well with each other, you know, like, it just all flows perfectly, in my opinion, so this is probably my favorite effect in the game right now. Unless we find another gem here today, which honestly I don't really have high hope high hopes for, but uh let's try it. Let's do the STR21. Let's see what that looks like. Another two for one kind of deal. Oh she looks good. Oh yeah, that that looks that looks solid. Nice aura. Um a little bit of a special effect with the, the orb as well. Now if it was bigger, it would look better. But since it's a tiny orb, it's not as nice, but still solid, solid. And her transformation is... Oh, 
Hold up. There's literally no effect on her transformation. It's literally all diamond background. Unless this is a glitch. Did I like my did my game break or something? Like what? Why? Why is there no effect at all on her card art except for the ugly ass diamond rainbow background? Like what is this? I want my money back, man. <laughs> I want my sticker back. <laughs> yeah, I just feel like I got ripped off. Okay, on, on the bright side, at least at least D21 herself, you know, before the transformation looks good. So uh, I can't get too mad at it, but that's pretty disappointing, guys. That's pretty disappointing. Now I know my girl, Android18, the one that just got an Extremes the Awakening. Actually, didn't even fully Extremes the Awakener yet. That's my bad. But let's give her... A sticker because I feel like she's gonna have a pretty nice effect with the beam right here. Oh! <laughs> Yo! You know, it's not that crazy, but there's something about the way that. I don't know, the two effects are working together that just. It just works for me, man. It, ju it just works for me. I, maybe it's 18. Maybe it's just the Android 18, you know, goggles. Um, but, dude, that is actually really nice to me. You know? Like, in my eyes, that's like an 8 out of 10. That's probably, like, my second or third favorite effect we've we've seen so far. I don't know. You let me know. Maybe maybe I'm just biased. Maybe it's, it's the Android 18 bias I recognize as a thing that I don't consciously control. So... Yeah, you let me know, guys. But since we gave 18 the sticker, we gotta give her brother 17 his sticker as well. So, there we go. He gets one as well. Should be something similar, I'm guessing. Yeah, very similar. And once again, very, very clean. Very, very clean. I like that. I like that. Okay, so 17 and 18 winners. Um, Attack Broly, I think, actually might be pretty decent with that orb up top. Big ball. Um, but it's not quite a, as big of a ball as you would like. It's kind of like a medium-sized ball. So, I'm going to keep my expectations fairly low here. Oh. You know, that's actually really clean. That's actually really clean. I should just start exclusively giving stickers to units with balls in their art, right? Because it just it, it, when when the focus is on like the orb, it just it looks really good. It really does. It's not amazing, and at the end of the day, it's still Super Saiyan 3 Broly, so you know it can only be so good. But <laughs> no disrespect. I just wish his EZA was better, but uh, that that was okay. That was okay. So next up, who should we do? Oh, you know what? I want to give some stickers to the fusions units. So I'm gonna filter by fusions. Let's see, fusions. Okay, and let's start with Weirus first. And I think Weirus does have potential because, as you can see at the bottom of his art, is a huge, huge orb, right? So here we go. Don't let me down, Weirus. I'm, ex I'm pretty excited, man, for this one. Let's see. I was right. Yeah, I was right. Look at that, man. I was 100% right. <laughs> the theory the theory is really holding true, I guess. I'm not sure if that was the correct statement or the, the right saying. But the point is... Um, these guys are proving me right, you know, these guys are definitely proving me right. Just, if you have any doubts about whether a card's gonna look good with a sticker or not, just see if they have a big circle in their art. And if they do, then chances are they'll probably look really, really good, you know? So, I, I say that's another winner, that's like an 8.5. Yeah, 8.5, 8.5 out of 10. The only reason I don't give him more is because he doesn't have any other effects. I think uh, if they had like a background aura or something like that, that would have been even better. Um, this guy, I don't think he's going to look that good. Um, okay, you know what? Even though this one I think is going to be very, very tame, I, I do have to give 
Chiao Man a sticker because he is a legend. So he deserves it no matter what. And yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> that is what I thought. That's barely an effect. Yo, that 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 is barely an effect. Like it should they should determine how many stickers or like how much of a sticker an effect costs based on how good or how many effects you're actually getting, right? So like this should be like 0.5 of a sticker. Honestly, like this should cost half a sticker. Whereas something like the Weirdest one can cost one sticker and I'd be okay with it, but this is like nothing. I mean compare this to literally Weirdest Who we just saw like it's just it's night and day It's not even close But okay, I guess that's just how it is um Who else who else? Hmm, I think maybe Selza could be good. Yeah, Selza could be really good. Selza could be really, really good. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah. The theory. Still holding, man. It, it, it's still holding strong. Okay. So, Selza is a winner. I like that. Um, Who else? We should go pretty quick now because I feel like this video is going very long. I've been talking a lot, so that's my apologies. Uh... Maybe Yamhan. I kind of want to give one to Karoli because he t does have the two balls. So for two balls, we'll give one to Karoli as well. Come on. Karoli. Yeah. No, that's a winner. <laughs> that's a winner. Great aura. Super Saiyan aura. Um, You know, you got the spikes, the green spikes, and then the, 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 the orbs. I keep saying balls. I, I feel like you guys are probably tired of me saying that, so... I'm gonna say orbs from now on. The two orbs uh, look fantastic. They look absolutely. I mean, the only issue I have with like the effects for like some of these cards is like I feel like the effects going too fast. You know, it feels like it's just too crazy. It's too chaotic. But maybe they were going for that. Um, I kind of like it when it's a little bit more slowed when it's a little bit more controlled. I guess that's my preference, but it is what it is. That looks great. And I gotta give one, give one to Barlot too, just because they work very well together. And I can't have one with a sticker and one without, right? So, yeah, this is what I kind of expected, man. Barlot's kind of boring. That effect's kind of boring, but it's not bad. It's alright. It's alright. Oh, um, I have a feeling these guys are gonna be disappointing, but I do have to give them stickers just because of the value they represent. It's five for one. Five arts for one sticker each. And of course, I'm talking about the AGL Goku and also the Tech Frieza. So starting here with the Goku. Um, okay, you know what? Decent. That is basic but clean. Yeah, basic but clean. I can't be mad at that. I cannot be mad at this effect. Okay, let's do Super Saiyan 2. They could have done something with the lightning. Okay, the lightning in the back, yo, if that was like moving and stuff, you know, if there was some kind of lighting effect with that, that would have been perfect. Uh, Super Saiyan 3, once again, nothing with the lightning, just the aura, bigger aura, I guess. Super Saiyan God. Ooh, oh, I like that. I, I, I like that a lot, actually. And as you can see, the, the red light coming from the ground is also kind of shimmering a little bit. Unless... That's just the diamond effect. That might be the diamond uh, the, the diamond background effect, actually, instead of just like an actual shimmer. But either way, it looks like it's shimmering. It looks good. And lastly, Super Saiyan Blue. Why couldn't they do anything with the lightning, man? If they did something with the lightning in each background... Then this card or this this sticker would feel a hundred percent more worth it. But okay, well this is kind of what I was expecting, you know, kind of basic stuff. At least we're getting five for one, so I feel like I'm getting good value. And we have the Frieza here. I like that more. Yeah, no, I like I like the aura more for the Frieza compared to the Goku so far. All right, second form. See, yo, they just had to do this. With the Goku, go, the Goku Lightning, 
and I would have been much happier. But now Frieza has the lightning, but no aura or nothing around him, so it still makes for kind of a boring effect for the Frieza. Third form. Okay, I'm glad they did something with the the flames, because otherwise just the lightning alone would have been pretty boring. So this one is probably the best one so far for Frieza. And then final form. Same thing. Except more flames. <laughs> and then lastly we have Golden Frieza. Um, more lightning, sharper, more focus flames. Not bad. Not bad. Like a solid 7. 7.5 even maybe. Uh, some, somewhere in that range. Nothing crazy, but good value at the very least. Okay, um, next up, who should we give the remaining few stickers to? Uh, it's a tough call, but I think maybe full power Super Saiyan 4. I hope they do something cool with the dragon in the back. And, uh, you know, with his eventual EZA coming, this is definitely a good candidate. Uh, uh, I mean, it's marginally better, honestly, than the Chow Man. It's like very similar. I think it is a bit better, <laughs> but not by much. <laughs> not by much. All right. Well, it is what it is. Um. Oh, also, I have a feeling that AGL Turles is going to be getting Extreme Z Awakening for uh, Saiyan Day, so I got to give him one. Let's see it. Come on, Turles. It's okay. It's decent. It's decent. Um, oh, what about SDR Namek Goku? Oh, he has one. What did that look like again? Oh, nothing crazy, I guess. Oh, that's pretty clean. Uh, that one's pretty clean. And this one is solid as well. Okay, so that was not a bad investment. That was not a bad investment. Uh, yo, tech hit, for sure. Just because of how good he is, not because he necessarily will look good, which he doesn't really. He doesn't look bad, but not. Mm, it's not great. It's not great. Okay. Um, I kind of want to end on a high note. That's why I'm still going, right? Because <laughs> we're already past 30. Or sorry, uh, past 20. I don't really want to spend too many beyond there. Well, I want to end on a high note, and this guy ain't it either. I'm trying to find the next SDR Omega Shenron. That, that's really what it is. Like, I'm trying to find the next guy that's just going to, like, blow me away when I first see it. And I'm like, ugh, this is not it. This is not it. Uh, maybe Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta. He has potential. He has potential, based on my theory. All right, Super Saiyan 3 STR Vegeta. Come on. Oh, wow, that looks really cool. That looks really, really cool. It's like water. It looks like water. It's like a water effect almost. Yo, I could stare, I could stare at that like all day. Honestly, like I could stare at that for a very long time. It just, it's, it's so mesmerizing. It's like staring into like a waterfall. I don't know if that's the right analogy, but you guys know what I mean, right? It's just very like fluid. It's, it's really cool. We could end it there. We could end it there, but I think we might be able to find something even better. I think we might be able to one-up it. Uh, ooh, oh, maybe Goku. Maybe Kao can Goku. Big Blast. Big Kamehameha. Oh wow. I've never been more disappointed. <laughs> Based on my expectations of what this is going to be. Uh, I have never been more disappointed. Okay, so I'm not even going to give the Fizz Vegeta a sticker. Just because it's probably going to be something similar. And it's just... It's, it's, a, it's a no. It's, it's a no. Um. Oh, yo, look at, yo, look at this. This guy, I think. I, I think this guy might be my favorite. I think this guy might be my favorite. I mean, it's close between him and the uh, the Omega Shenron, but uh, yeah, 
yeah, like this dude is so clean, man. Why haven't I found one like this today? I need to find one like this today before I go. Otherwise, it's just gonna... I'm just gonna feel sad. Um... What would they do with the ghosts for the Buhan? I'm intrigued. So they don't do, they don't do anything with the ghosts. Background's kind of cool, but not not really too crazy. I mean, that's that's it's nice. It's nice. It's definitely not the most disappointing today. That would be Kaoken Goku for sure. Um, hmm, Mass Saiyan maybe, maybe Mass Saiyan, I think he has potential as well, with the aura, and the orb, and the, the spikiness, it's a little too crazy for me man, it's too fast, like why do they have to make it so fast, that's my main problem with stuff like this man, it's just too crazy, it's too chaotic. Okay, um, one more, one more, let's try, uh, I mean, I didn't give Fizz Vegeta one yet, I guess I should give him one, even though I think it's gonna be exactly the same thing as Goku, like literally identical effects to Goku, because they're lazy like that, yeah, that's what I thought, that's what I thought. So we'll we'll go through the forms, but it's it's literally Goku, but with Vegeta. Um, hold on, where'd he go? Is Vegeta? Yep, yep. There you go. Super Super Vegeta. As you can see, just the aura. Oh my bad. Super Saiyan Two Vegeta. Just the aura. Super Saiyan God. You know, nice like red effect. And then Super Saiyan Blue with the blue aura as well. You know, it's basically Goku's effects with uh, Vegeta instead of a Goku. Ah, uh, okay. I'm gonna go deep. I'm gonna go deep. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go lower. Let's go down here. Um, he has a lot of potential, guys. This this Spirit Bomb Goku has a lot of potential, so I'm gonna give him one. And hopefully, he's the one we can end on. That's good. That's really good. It's not exactly on the level that I was expecting or hoping for, rather. It's very good, though. It's very, very good, though. Okay, okay, one more. Oh, crap. Um, yeah, let's go one more. I'm gonna go deep again. And we're gonna give it to... Let's see... Uh, maybe, no, not Baby Janemba, maybe, uh, see, I would love to give it to Android 18, but I don't think she's going to have a good effect, and I don't want to end on disappointment. What about Manta Vegeta? No. What about Fizz Broly? Maybe Fizz Bro maybe Fizz Broly. He's kind of like... Of the same era as some of the some of my favorite effects, right? So, mm, not quite, not quite. All right. Um, how about? Hmm, getting a little desperate here, guys. Getting a little bit desperate. I just need one. I just need one really good one. Oh, maybe go ten. Yeah, there's potential there. Maybe go 10. Um, how about... I already gave this guy one. Um, how about... Frieza was good. Maybe Jiren? I don't think so. I think there's a high chance for disappointment with Jiren. Maybe... Mmm... It's tough, man. I don't... I don't really know who to go for at this point um yeah rose was not bad rose was not bad what about this 
Full power. Oh, Frieza. Okay, full power Frieza. Here we go. Come on. Uh, it's alright. It's alright. Could have been a lot better, though. Could have been way better than what we got there. Um, nope, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, probably not. Gotenks, probably not. Uh, what about this Vegeta? Oh, oh yeah, he was good. He was very good. But, you know, he already has, he already has a sticker, so we can't choose him. Um, last one, guys. Yo, we gotta make it count. Gotta make it count. Let's do... Mm. Yeah, I'm having a hard time. I'm really having... Oh, Trunks with his sword. Trunks with the sword. It didn't do anything with the sword. I mean, that was pretty obvious, right? Like, they could have made it, like... Is it glowing a bit? It's glowing a bit. Okay, it's doing something. But I gotta say, I was expecting more. I was expecting more. Okay, uh, I guess one more then. One more. Uh, how about... How about... The Tech Golden Frieza, maybe? Possibly? That's a dope aura. That that's a that's a that's a clean clean aura. Yo, I've been going for so long that <laughs> the music I prepared for this video is gonna run out. So uh, let me just quickly find something suitable here. Um, why not the Goku and Piccolo theme? Okay. Uh. I just I don't want to end on on Golden Frieza. That was not like the the greatest. So we need one more. We need one more, and that lucky unit will be maybe Toa. No, Toa doesn't have anything special in her art that would suggest she would look good. Maybe uh, Candy Vegito. I kind of want to give it to Candy Vegito, even though I think it's going to be trash, but it's Candy Vegito, so, like, can't really go wrong with that. Um, let me see, what about Trunks? Trunks has potential. Yes, he has some potential. Okay, yeah, okay, fine, Trunks. Come on, Trunks! Okay, we have a winner. We have a winner. It's solid. I'm gonna save five stickers. <laughs> I wanna hold on to my remaining five. So I think uh, I'm gonna have to just be satisfied with this. I'm gonna have to be satisfied with the Super Saiyan 3 Trunks effect. And you know, it's like a solid eight. It's, it's at least a solid eight. Is it, is it, you know, Kalkin Goku? Is it Omega Shenron? Is it? Fizz Cooler? Is it Fizz Beerus? No. Not really. Um, I don't think we're ever going to reach this level again. I, I, just, I just think that this is like the peak of sticker effects in the game, and it's just never going to reach that level ever again. Uh, oh, wait, hold on. Did I give the STR Super Saiyan Blue Cock and Goku a sticker? Oh, I did. And he was highly disappointing coming off of this, right? Because when I saw this, I was like, yo, the STR one must be amazing. And it wasn't. So, uh, yeah, there you go, guys. Um, unfortunately, we weren't able to find, like, a, 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 an amazing sticker effect. But we found some really good ones. Some really good ones. And that's going to do it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comments down below what your personal favorite sticker effect in the game is. And also, which one of these that you saw in this video is your favorite. Like, of the new ones that I did um, for today. So, yeah, that's all I got to say. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. Sub to the channel if you're new. Hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And until next time, 
Have an awesome, awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.